Jack Wilshere calls out football manager boss over his injuries on computer game. Jack Wilshere has called out an angry football manager gamer who complained about the former Arsenal player's conduct in his save. Wilshere, now at Arhas Gymnastik Verning, AGF, in the Danish Superliga after a two-year absence from football, posted a screenshot of a Twitter conversation between two online users. The first one wrote, took a gamble on at Jack Wilshere in Football Manager 22. Four appearances later he's out injured for three months. Someone responded with, are you surprised? To which they said, then he complained about me not signing enough people in midfield. Wanted a transfer away. Not realizing he will fail a medical, no matter where he went. I've got an injury release clause on him as well, but I'd rather him suffer in the UNDER 23s. And Wilshere saw the funny side of the discussion. He wrote on Twitter with the screenshot attached and accompanied with laughing images, mismanagement if you ask me. Can't lie this made me laugh. The 30-year-old recently spoke to TalkSport about he was settling into life at Arhas following his release from Bournemouth in 2021. The former England international said that their fans were some of the best he's ever come across. Speaking about his debut, a 3-2 defeat to Vigil BK, he told the radio station, it was a proper debut. It was end-to-end -end and was 2-2. It was the worst pitch I've ever seen. Do you think Wilshere will return to English football? Let us know in the comments section. Then, halfway through the second half, bang, the floodlights go out. Everyone went back into the dressing room, there was a 15 or 16 minute delay, and then back out. When I came on in the 90th minute there was still 15 minutes added on. It was really about 72 minutes when I came on. They scored a set piece, and as you know, I'm average height, but they are quite tall over here, and I can't do much on set pieces. Wilshere added, our fans, I will say they are the best I've ever seen. In the warm-up they were there singing right from the warm-up. They had 2,500 fans there. 